Hello everybody, it's Mick from Jester Bushcraft and in today's video I'm going to be talking about alternatives to these readily available uh, adventure foods, these backpacking ration packs. Um, the reason I wanted to do this video is recently I did a wild camp in the Lake District and this particular uh, adventure food pack which is an expedition breakfast which is like a porridge uh, I tried that for my breakfast and I have to be honest the taste was pretty rotten I didn't enjoy it at all it was horrible to me it was like vomit but what I decided to do is these packs are reusable they've got a zip lock across the top and I thought why don't I try and recreate my own uh, backpacking ration packs to the taste that I want so that's what I'm going to do today right what I'm going to do is I'm going to make my own sort of breakfast porridge recipe I don't know what the measurements are going to be so I'm just going to play it by ear but what I'm going to use is I'm going to use this kind of thing which is your uh, single pack porridge uh, little sachet uh, loads of different people make these, Aldi do them, this is the Quaker Oats one loads of different flavours uh, you normally chuck that in a bowl, add some milk and put it in the microwave but uh, I'm going to use it to make my own uh, breakfast ration pack so I've decided to use two of those um, I've also got some cinnamon which I usually add to my porridge so I'm going to be using that uh, I'm going to use some powdered milk which I've just poured all over the uh, counter because I've left the top off uh, I'm going to use some powdered milk or coffee mate and I'm going to add in some cheap uh, sultanas as well because I, like I like sultanas in my porridge so what we'll do is we'll chuck all that in the, uh, in the pack and uh, we'll take it from there after I've cleaned all that up right all cleaned up now um, these packs are pretty good actually um, they have a sort of bottom on that opens out to make a sort of flat base I'm just going to open that up like that and then we're going to get our porridge sachet rip that open there's no science to this just chuck it in so I've got two of those, chuck it in and then I think I'll add, uh, it says two heaped teaspoons of the coffee mate for a, for a coffee or a cup of tea so I'm going to use four heaped teaspoons so that's one, two, three Four. Four of those. A uh, splash of cinnamon. I do like my cinnamon in my porridge. And then I'm just going to add a handful of raisins. Just like that. Chuck them in. And those that escaped. And that's basically it. Let's give it a mix round and that's it good to go so all we need to do now uh, is obviously just seal that up get all the air out oops didn't quite close that up properly so the ends all flattened down now so now you've got yourself a nice flat package there with the uh, breakfast of your choice. So we can put that into a backpack and then when we're ready to eat it we can just open it up, open the bottom up so you can stand it, give it a shake. And then we can just add the boiling water up to the uh, up to the line there, up to the six mark, which it says in the instructions. Seal it up and leave for eight minutes. Right, 
let's try that. Right, I've boiled my water and I'm going to fill the uh, pack up to the six mark. Let's see how we get on. about right. So look, yep, okay, I'm gonna give that a stir. This is all same technique as the um, product that you get that comes in the bag. Give it a good stir. Stand for eight minutes. That's for eight minutes done. Let's check it out. Give it another stir. The consistency looks good. Give it a taste. I'll tell you what, it's a lot nicer than what that was in there. It wasn't nice at all. Mm. That's good. Yeah, I could definitely eat that. Consistency is good as porridge should be. And it's a flavour that I like. You can just make that up to your own flavour. You saw what I did at the beginning. Um, just added the ingredients. Um, four teaspoons of powdered milk or coffee mate. Bit of cinnamon, some raisins, you can chuck anything, some ground nuts, whatever you like. You might have to work with the different measures. I was just lucky that what I chucked in is absolutely perfect for the just the right size meal. So I've used the same technique, took everything in, I boil them water up to the level, the number six, seal it up, leave it for eight minutes, give it a stir. Jobs are good. And when you're finished, just give it a rinse out, clean it out, make sure it's nice and dry inside, and then you're ready to go for your next meal, whatever you decide to choose. Give it a try. If you uh, if you if you do give it a try, leave a comment. Tell me what flavors you've used, and 
maybe you've done something other than like a breakfast meal. Maybe you've done a, I don't know, a main meal or a pudding. So, uh, so yeah, let me know in the comments. Hope oh, you enjoyed that. If you did, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next video. I wonder what I'll choose next time. Hmm.